Good morning, guys. Exciting day. I'm going soon. I'm going to get dressed. Uh, I did my hair, but I just need to put clothes on. Uh, I'm going to the airport to pick up Lydia Kate. Yay. Um, Linda and Charles, um, they told me their flight information. So I'm going to go and I'm going to wait in the cell phone lot. And I'm going to pick her up. I'm going to meet with them for a few minutes. Um, and then I'm going to bring her home. I am so excited. They are actually going to visit around San Diego. And then they're going up to L.A. to see L.A. before they fly home. Um, so they could make like a trip out of this. Um, but yes, this is so super exciting. I'm going to pick her up. Yay. So yeah, follow me on this journey. Hey guys. So I haven't left yet. I'm getting ready to leave. I have my Elle's flight shirt on. Um, cause she's coming home. Um, yeah, this is exciting. I am, ooh, I, I, I don't know. I am just a mixed emotions, but like good mixed emotions, like happy and like overwhelmed. Um, and I know that mommy is excited, which, oh man, I can't wait. Um, I, this is it's going to be fun. It's going to be a wild ride for the like four days that she's here. We're going to be super busy. We've got doctor's appointments. We've got stuff we got to do. But it's going to be fun. And I am so excited. I think I said that. But yes. So I'm going to go get her. I'm getting ready to go right now. Bye. Welcome home, Katie. Yep, she's conked out. We had a big long, well, she had a big long flight all the way from Australia. She flew from, her, Linda, and Charles flew from Australia to a red eye flight from Australia to Honolulu. And then they had a few hour layover to stretch their legs to, you know, get out in the sun, get her out of her constraints of being tied up. And, well, not tied up, but just, you know, like, in the airplane seat for 15 hours. And then, from there, they got on a plane, and they came to San Diego. And I went and picked her up, and we said hi, and <clears throat> they are going to do some sightseeing. And then go up to L.A., do some sightseeing, and then fly back home to Australia. They figured if they're going to come out here, they might as well make a trip of it. So, yeah, there she is. She's, yeah, she's conked out, so I'm going to let her sleep, and then we have an eye appointment later, so we'll check in for that. Bye! Hey guys, hey guys. Um, we're back, well, I mean, whatever. Uh, we're getting ready to leave for her eye appointment, she's still in her cute little dress, um, her little feetsies. And, uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Hey guys, so we're here at the doctor's office. Uh, we're waiting to go in. We've been checked in and they, let's see, they suited her with a nice little bracelet. And it, it tells them about her milk allergy, which is good. Not that that would ever be a thing here because we're just going to get your little eyes checked but you never know and I'd hate for her to get sick while she's with me um, but yeah she's just having a good old time 
still sleeping away. I woke her up for a bottle and then um, she fell asleep in the car, which is great because then that helps. Uh, but she'll have to wake up soon for her eye appointment. So we'll, uh, we'll see how that goes. I'm really curious to see if there's anything that needs to be changed, anything that needs to happen, if it's gotten worse, if it's gotten better. Um, but yeah, so we'll see. Hey guys, quick, quick, we're home. And it went well, you were such a good girl. You didn't cry, you didn't nothing. You were such a good girl. I thought you would be really scared because they poked at you and they did some stuff. And they put some medicine in your eyes. But you're all good. Yeah, look at her. She's just still conked out. She fell asleep again. I think she she wasn't... Um, she wasn't um, scared. But I think just the stress of it. Just went, now that we're home. Like... The lighting in here, big girl. Now that we're home, like, she was just done with being touched. Like, she, you know, it's not that she hated it, but now that she, we're home, like I said, yeah, she's just done with being touched and whatnot and being messed with. So, yeah. I'm so proud of you. You did so good. Auntie is so proud of you. And you know what? Mommy's going to be so proud of you, too. Nothing's changed. Uh, it's still good. Um, no, no numbers changing or nothing like that. You didn't get worse and you didn't get better. So it would have been nice to be a little bit better, but that's okay. We're okay with that. So we'll see you guys. We're going to have another bottle and hang out and just chill. Maybe watch some YouTube or TV or something just to relax a little bit. Um, but yeah, bye. Hey guys. So you see my bag in the back. I'm getting ready to pick that up. But, well, today's the day. Baby Kate is getting on the airplane and going home to see her mommy. Yeah, she is. This dress is my favorite on her, so I think she's gonna wear it. She's wearing it home. But there's a we're gonna meet someone at the airport because I can't fly all the way over there. We're gonna meet someone at the airport, a social worker that's gonna take you, get you on the airplane, and get you to Georgia, and then mommy's gonna go pick you up. And you're going to see mommy. Yep. She's asleep now. She doesn't look too thrilled. But, and I'm not thrilled because <laughs> I want her to stay. I want her to stay forever. But you have a mommy you have to go home to that wants to see you really bad. But yeah, we're getting ready to get on the airplane. Say hi mommy. Say see you soon. And so we'll, I'll put her on an airplane and get her out of here.